Hey girl, hey, and welcome back to my channel. It is Ali Marie. For those of you who are new, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. For those of you who are not new, make sure you like, comment, and share. So today I'm just going to be sharing with you guys a quick video on my nighttime slash self-care routine. I think it's very important that we take care of ourselves and treat ourselves during this time. Um, we've experienced a lot, a lot of trauma amid this pandemic and for me personally I've kind of graduated come back home I'm trying to settle back in I haven't been all that comfortable so I think it's important for me to take a day and I'm going to take you guys through my night and what I do so the first thing I like to do is just get my setup going I like to burn a candle before I hop in the shower so the candle that I'm burning today is the stress relief I think it's eucalyptus and spearmint by Bed Bath, not Bed Bath and Beyond. Actually, yeah, Bed Bath and Beyond. I'm thinking, no, Bath and Body Works. Oh my God, what's wrong with you? I'm also gonna put on some good mood music, and I will share below in the description box um, which two playlists it is that I like to listen to while I'm relaxing. Now it is time for me to prepare for my shower. There isn't much that I have to do to my hair since I have braids, but there are some things that I like to do to prevent my hair from getting wet and to preserve my hairstyle. So first I'm just going to take down my braids and I'm going to tie my edges down with an edge scarf because we already know how edges like to act in the shower once they get steamed to them. I don't want them flying up everywhere. I'm also putting my hair in a bun so that my shower cap can fit on top of my braids because like I said I really want to preserve this hairstyle I don't want to get it frizzy and then I also have some curly pieces in there so to prevent all frizz I'm going to wear a shower cap you guys will also notice that I am NOT removing any makeup that is because I did not wear any makeup today I actually just finished working out before making this video so there is no need for me to use any wipes or anything like that plus I'll be washing my face towards the middle of my self care routine alright let's get naked off to the shower I go and of course my shower temperature is on melt my skin I don't know why, we just do it, I don't know why. So I'll be using some of my favorite products in the shower, which is the Dove Body Wash as well as the Johnson's Baby Gel. Both of those are in lavender, which is an amazing essential oil if you are trying to relax and calm yourself down. And then I also have this Tree Hut Body Scrub, and I'm still trying to see how I feel about it, but I'm going to use it today. Please enjoy this quick commercial break on some self-care tips for you to try at home for yourself and we'll get right back to the program is scheduled in just a moment. So everyone knows that it's law that you hop in some comfortable PJs after a nice hot shower. Um, to be honest, typically I'm just an oversized t-shirt type of gal, but for the sake of this video I have on some really cute pajamas with the silk robe and the silk shorts and you know. But anyways, I'm preparing my face. I'm just washing my face for my face mask and I'm about to put on the face mask that I use. It's a very simple and easy DIY face mask that you can make yourself. I will put in the description box or either in the video. Um, what ingredients I use is literally just two honey and turmeric and I'll tell you, tell you guys how much. But preparing myself for that face mask and then I'm going to let that face mask sit for about 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. 
While I wait for my face mask to marinate on my face, then I'm going to paint my toes because your girl has not been to nobody's nail shop. But it's okay because I know how to do this skill at home. I got it down packed. And I'm doing it off camera because the feet pigs ain't free. Sorry. Now once I finish dancing like somebody's grandma, I'm going to wash this stuff off my face. And make sure y'all wash this stuff off good because if you don't, you're going to wake up to yellow pillowcases and yellow sheets. Turmeric don't play no games. So I like to wash my face again, but the, this time I'm washing my face with some black soap. The last thing I'm going to do for my face tonight after the mask is washed off is apply some aloe vera gel as well as some oil and rub that into my skin because I want to retain some moisture. I don't want my face drying out. And after that, I will meet you guys in my kitchen. Well, welcome to my kitchen. No matter if I'm having a good day or a bad day, on a self-care day, I'm having myself a glass of wine. I think the glass that I'm, or the wine that I'm drinking today is Riesling. I don't know by who, but it was definitely on the label. For sure, I got that wine from Target. I also like to get my diffuser together. The scent that I'm using, or that I just always use for my diffuser is lavender. Because like I said, lavender helps calm and relax the body. And that's what I need during this time. I need calm and relaxation because COVID ain't doing it for me. You feel me? So the very last thing that I enjoy doing on a self-care night is literally just chilling. Like I'm going to sip on my wine. Um, I really like putting on a playlist. There's this one playlist that I've been listening to a lot lately. It's by an artist friend of mine. So you guys will definitely see that being pulled up on my screen. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to relax. Sometimes I like to journal. Sometimes I like to read a book. Sometimes I like to watch Netflix. It all depends. Like, it's okay to switch it up. I usually switch it up. But as you're developing a self-care routine, just do things that make you comfortable. Do things that make it easy for you to relax. Um, it doesn't have to be the same thing over, but it also can be consistent if that works for you. I'm very interested in hearing what it is that you guys do for during your self-care routine though. So if you guys will definitely drop that in the comment box or the comment section. Um, maybe I can try some of these out. Maybe I can incorporate these into my self-care routine because I do like to switch it up. But that is all that I have for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.